Hello, my name is John Nello from Montclair, New Jersey, owner operator of Auto Tech on Wheels. I've been in business probably like around 22 years doing mobile diagnostics for repair shops in northern New Jersey. Uh, probably like around 1,200 repair shops, uh, today's count, and close to 500 body shops. I use a lot of uh, IATN's information in the knowledge base, which helps my business. Uh, for instance, gathering information on waveform patterns that I don't have, I may not have time to collect for crank cap, crankshaft correlation problems to rule out timing chain issues. I can actually go to the database and I will find something there relating to the car I'm working on, pull it up and do a comparison to what I have and it's, it's, it's a great thing to have. It's another asset, another tool asset for my arsenal of tools I have on board. And it, it's just, the bottom line, helps fix cars. And there may be unique problems that you may not see all the time that someone else has seen before you. And it may be something that you may not find with your tool or in your information system. So I'll go to IATN, I'll plug in a problem card I have, and someone's seen this unique problem, and I'm like, wow, this guy's seen it, and I read up on it. And it's not like a cheat sheet, it's actually a tool, another tool for you to use in your industry. Hi, I'm Scott Gonzo Weaver from Spear Electric out of Tulsa, Oklahoma. I use IATN on a regular basis, one of the best resources for automotive information. How you doing? My name is Paul Danner. I teach at Rosedale Technical Institute in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Um, I've been a member of IATN for probably 12 years. Uh, I have a mobile diagnostic business, so when I'm done teaching during the day, I you know, travel around and you know, work for different garages. One of the main things I use IATN for would be you know, reference library, trying to get good waveforms. Uh, also, maybe some tips before I you know, get to my garages on different cars and different problems that I have. Um, certainly an asset. IATN has been for me for the past 12 years. I recommend it to all my students and uh, you know, it's really helped further my career. Um, education would be another thing too. You want to learn something, you, know, you can Google it and whatever, but you know, the real guys are on IATN where you get good information. So I you know, appreciate everything you guys do for me and thank you very much. I've been an IATN member for, uh, I don't know, probably 15 years, 14 years. Um, and I'm not technical, so that makes me a little different than most IATN users. Um, I'm more of a lurker. I go on and I look to see what people are saying so that I know what's going on in the industry and it helps me keep track of what it is. So I think IATN is a great thing and I recommend it to shop owners all the time. So. Hello, my name is Sergio. I work for the ATG. I'm a member of uh, IATN since 2005. And let me tell you guys, I use the website every day uh, when I fix a car or when I need to make a research. You will find a good information, technical information, waveforms. Uh... Hi, I'm Eldon from Ohio, and um, I've been on AATN for more than 10 years. And um, it's a wonderful, wonderful resource for information and uh, a lot of learning uh, opportunities there. So, and... hey, this is Richard out from Santa Barbara, California, and what I see in the value of IATN, oh my gosh, since the inception, AOL, dial-up, to now, the ability to be able to network with mechanics all over the world is incredible. And all of us have always had issues where we have called our friend to ask him about fixing a car. Imagine having thousands and thousands and thousands of friends. IATN, right on. I'm Matt Fonzel from Red Wing, Minnesota. I've been on IATN for quite a while now. Uh, when I first joined up, uh, I thought I actually knew a few things. I quickly learned that I had a lot to learn, and IATN was a great uh, conduit to finding ways to learn more and open up my horizons as a technician, and also led into some uh, training opportunities. Um, here at Vision, I've been coming here since about 2005. Uh, probably the best event I know of for the automotive repair industry for training and trade show. Uh, my name is Zach Eggleston. Uh, I've been a member on IATN for seven years. Uh, I'm a Business Plus sponsor. Uh, I've got all my technicians using it now, and, as well as my service rider. Uh, IATN has been a tremendous source uh, for me personally through the years, um, learning from a lot of very smart people, and uh, it's tremendously increased my level of competency as a technician, and also, as far as the management end of the business goes, um, 
it has helped me a lot there as well. Hi, my name is John Bridgewater. I own Bridgewater Automotive in Castro Valley, California. I've been in the business for uh, 28 years. Uh, I've been a member of IATN since 1997. Been to several different conventions, met a lot of really great people. Um, I'm, uh, I, in very large part, I owe my career to IATN because without them, I probably would have just been stuck in some job with no training and, uh, and uh, no networking. So uh, I highly recommend IATN to anybody considering it. I'm Mike Yoakum. I've been an IATN member for 16 years. It's my window into the world. It's my way of finding out what's going on in shops and in service bays all over the United States and all over the world. Hello, I am uh, Thomas Perkins from Springfield, Missouri. Been a, I've been a member of IATN since 99. Um, IATN has kind of shaped my career by giving me the connection to my peers, um, allowing me to study case studies online and the waveform database has been invaluable for doing auto repair. Um, I've added to the database, I've drawn from the database and Basically, the people connection from IATN has been invaluable. My name is Travis Wolf, uh, owner of Mobile Diagnostics and Programming in Wichita, Kansas. And IATN has made it possible for me to meet people from all over the world and share information and knowledge everywhere. Thank you.